Hey guys, it's Dan, your host of your Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for another Walking Dead video for today. This is going to be doing my non-spoiler review for this week's episode of The Walking Dead Season 10C. This is going to be for Season 10, Episode 21, Diverged. What if you really are broken? You just realized it a whole lot later than everyone else did. Okay guys, just gonna be doing another video for today. This one's gonna be doing my non-spoiler review for this week's episode of The Walking Dead Season 10 C. This is gonna be for The Walking Dead Season 10 Episode 21, Diverge. So uh, this is going to be my non-spoiler review for this week's episode of The Walking Dead. Of course, we only have one episode left after this one, which is the Here's Negan episode, which I cannot wait to see, which of course, we are gonna discuss a lot coming up in the next week or so. But for this episode right here, so uh, this was going to be, at least according to the reviewers the worst episode of season 10 c um and i know a lot of people everybody's gonna have their own opinions everybody's gonna kind of feel you know a different way um in my opinion this smokes episode 20 i'm sorry it does uh it's not it's still not amazing it's still not anything incredible but i do think this episode is pretty darn good and i for people that say that this is the worst episode ever um i'm sorry i think they're way off i'm sorry i think the reviewers are way off there actually is a lot of moments in this week's episode that i was sitting there and i'm like i like this scene i like how they presented that i like how they did that i liked how they did this so um I don't know. I for a lot of people that say that this episode is just it's just boring or it's terrible or there's no point to it. Um I just I don't understand that. I think it's it's a really good episode. Is it filler at times? Yes, I will say that. But I actually do think it is, in my opinion, a lot better than episode 20 last week, like by a lot, because I just, I, episode 20, I had a lot of problems with, you know, with a lot of the stuff they did. This one, it's a Daryl and Carol episode where basically they are, you know, their friendship is kind of, you know, not going so great. And of course, they kind of go on their own separate journeys in this episode. We see uh, Daryl and the stuff that he does on the outside. And then we also see Carol uh, in Alexandria with Jerry and with a few others. And I will say Jerry is a really cool addition to this episode. Um, I like the scenes with him in this episode. I won't go too much into it, but I will say that he has some good moments in this one. Uh, one um, near the end of the episode that I actually really do like a lot as well too. Um, and I think that this episode for Jerry, I think was cool because we haven't really seen him in, in this half season at all. So now the other thing about this episode I do like is uh, Daryl. Uh, I like some of the scenes with him on the outside. I think this episode does have some cool stuff there. Um, obviously I won't go into what really happens and there's nothing major I'll just say with these kind of supply runs that Carol and Daryl have on the outside. There's nothing major there, but I think the execution on how they did it was pretty darn good. Um, like that scene as well, too, where you've got uh, Carol in the trailer who's like, first you, and you, and you, and oh, and you, and you, you know? Uh, I like that scene. I thought that was really cool, and uh, honestly, that was, uh, I, you know, it, I think we needed an episode like this for Carol just because she hasn't really necessarily been my favorite personally, and I know for a lot of you guys as well, too, uh, Carol, the character, has kind of gone downhill in season 10, but I think this episode... Uh, definitely is one of the better ones for Carol for season 10. I still like season 10 episode 16 Carol a lot though, uh, but this one, um, it's a close second to that, I would say. Maybe not necessarily as good as that, but I would say, like, in terms of, like, for the Carol character, but um, I will say that for uh, Carol as a character, definitely uh, it is a pretty good episode for her. Um, and I do like some of the stuff they do. Now, I will say another thing about this episode that I think you guys uh, might be surprised about is actually the amount that we get to see of Dog. Uh, Dog is a character that is actually very involved in this episode, which I, I didn't actually expect. Uh, but we do see a lot of Dog in this episode. So definitely any Dog fans out there, I would look forward to this episode if I were you. So um, it's a great character episode uh, for Daryl, but mainly for Carol. And Carol, uh, Carol is, you know, kind of our main character for this episode. And uh, yeah, that is basically that. So that is all I got to say about this week's episode of Walking Dead without delving into any kind of major spoilers or anything like that. It's a Daryl Carroll episode. We focus on some journeys that they go on in this one, some minor kind of supply runs and random stuff like this. But we also do go into kind of uh, Carol's character uh, and how she's kind of feeling after all the stuff that happened in season 10, which I feel like is some of the better stuff of the episode, uh, which obviously we'll discuss more in the spoiler-filled reviews. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. Write your comments in the comment section below. Let me know in the comment section below what do you guys think about this episode. Do you love it? Do you like it? Do you think it was okay or do you hate it? Let me know in the comment section below so anyway guys thank you guys for watching uh, watching this video write your comments in the comment section below if you guys are new here click the subscribe button to send my walking dead videos follow dance for walking dead videos come guys and of course i'll see you guys really soon for another walking dead video enjoy the rest of your day guys and peace out.